Jam and Shay Michaels. Tune up and milk it. 105.9 Jams. Five point nine jams, 918. It's 18 minutes after 9 o'clock. It's the Breakfast Jam Freestyle Friday <laughs> is what it is. It's Jay Michaels, Millie, the tuna man's out in the street. Spud's hanging out. Yes, I am hanging out. With me this morning. Uh, and tonight, you're going to be on the radio tonight. Yes, I'll be there too. You know, last night I was uh, driving uh, around. Well, I actually went to the store, and I heard uh, he had some crazy stuff on last night. He had a dating game on. Yeah, it was, it was buck wild. And it, and it sounded buck wild. Yeah. I mean, these people wouldn't let the other get off the phone. You yeah, get it, off the phone. No, you get <laughs> off the phone. It was crazy. You, no, you get off. And my man said, well, I didn't want to talk to you anyway. <laughs> it was funny. It was funny. I do it every Thursday. You know, Every so Thursday, so what is and, it? And, you know, it's, it's kind of hard because, you know, you try to get, you know, with the timing and everything, you know, a lot of people don't know when you're behind the scenes. It's timing and everything. So, you know, we, we roll with the first, you know what I'm saying, legitimate good sounding person, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and the main thing is, you know, a person doesn't have to get with him, you know, so. No. So that's fine. why, you know, it, it, it gets kind of, kind of Jerry Springer, you know what I'm saying? Who's this? Hello? This is Pontiac calling. This is who? Pontiac. Pontiac. Yeah. Pontiac, let me ask you a dumb question. Okay. Where are you calling from? I'm calling there from Pontiac. There you go, I knew it. Pontiac, all right. So, what can we do for you? Um, I have a question. Okay. Um, I'm trying to get a date with a guy. Okay. And I'm really trying to get off the phone. They didn't say oral sex, so we all know what intercourse is, or if it's true about. Wait a minute, wait. Well, how do you know that didn't happen? Oh, touchy feel. Wait, wait, hey, listen, uh, Pontiac. Yeah. How do you know that that uh, that didn't take place? Well, the, I've been watching it and everything, so. Well, the report comes out today. The report it, comes out today. Yeah, and they're gonna they're gonna tell you if he was doing it, doing it, and doing it well. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, he's a man. The only thing that I'm pissed off about, though, yeah. is because he got caught. Oh, you're the man he got caught, huh? We, we, yeah, we were kind of, we were kind of pulling for him. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> ah, you got caught, man. You know, he got caught. And, yeah. I mean, I think he shouldn't have been as sloppy as he was about it, but they couldn't get him on anything else. So, hey, well, we're going to throw it, Monica Lewinsky. He didn't smell a setup. You know what I'm saying? All right. Those Republicans trying to get him up out of there, you know, because to me, he's looking out for us. You know okay. Know yeah, I, I think, yeah. The but let me ask you this question real, real quick, real, real quick. You know what I'm saying? You say that he's looking out for us. The other girl said, you know what I'm saying, think about his daughter and everything like that. But does that justify, you know what I'm saying, no, your reaction, your accountability? No, that still doesn't, that still doesn't you know what I'm saying, justify that. It's cool he's looking out for us, but man still did wrong. Yeah, he still did wrong. Well, now we all do wrong. Would, we all do wrong, and when we do wrong, we what? Get you punished. Would, you would have never known, though. But he got punished. He's been he's been getting it. pretty. He's been getting punished pretty bad. That ain't that ain't no punishment. I mean, hey, just like the rest of them, they are done wrong too. Yeah. You know, but they just didn't blow it up as much, I guess, because he's a Democrat. You know how those Republicans. Are. <laughs> okay, oh, now we're, we're bipartisan around here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? All right. The Republicans just don't get it. You know, hey. Pontiac, Pontiac, Pontiac. What are you? Are you like the mayor of Pontiac or something? Okay. <laughs> All right. Thanks for calling us, sir. All right, dear. 105.9 Jams. Jams the hits guaranteed. Like moving on from my own silk shocker. <laughs> Cameron, a horse and carriage. Try to keep me on. Please, Please mama, sit down. Are you going to buy me diamonds? Man, the Irish is for hire. Mama, sit down. It's the hit music guarantee. 105.9 Jam. Fresh Jams. Want to hear something cool? Cool. Twist. Brought to you by Magic Works hey, Entertainment. You know you want me. 105.9 Jams, 924, 24 minutes after 9 o'clock. It's the Breakfast Jam Freestyle Friday, and our jam lines are still open for you. Coming up here in a minute, it's our uh, old school music teaser brought to you by the Michigan State Lottery. And my guy, the tuna man, is out in the streets. Hey. Hey, Jay, speaking of Janet Jackson, your chance to win a flyaway, courtesy of our friends over at Jack Daniels. But in order to win that free flyaway, Jay, you got to come by Franklin BC's. Tomorrow night party is going to be off the hook. How can you go? I got free passes for you right now. 
Jay, we are headed to Greenfield and Finkel. Meet me at the mobile station on Greenfield and Finkel for your free passes or free hookups to hang out with Tune Up Man at 105.9 Jam. All right, the Tune Up Man's hanging out. 924, here's Silk. Five point nine jams, the breakfast jam. It's nine thirty one. Ten o'clock. Sunny's gonna be in here at ten. And people are still calling us this, but talking about our president. You I know, have, uh, stirred up some stuff. You have stirred up some stuff, but there is some good news out there. It's some good news. Northwest out there. Airlines has Northwest settled. Northwest Airlines has settled. You know. I mean. So all those who um wanna fly Northwest, you know, those are I would wait a couple there. days, wait a couple days, and then you know what I'm saying, book a flight. Yeah, well, they haven't exactly said when they're going to start flying. I believe sometime next week. Uh -huh. I believe sometime next week. Wait so. a couple days after that. Yeah. You know, somebody so might get all deranged and crazy. But that's a good thing. I and mean, like we already said that. Um, dropping right. planes out the air. It's 9.30, 9.32. It's Farmer Jack Savings time where you can save on America's Choice gallon milk whole 3.25% or low fat. 1% just one ninety nine with your bonus savings club card. And of course, that is only at Farmer Jack. You and the name Moisturizing Body Wash from Oil of Olay. Proven to go beyond clean to caring. 105.9 Jams. Jams the hits guaranteed. Like JD and Jay-Z, money ain't a thing. Uh -huh. Price on money ain't a thing. Money down hard for my dogs that's locked in the bank. Uh -huh. When you hit the brakes, new whips, money ain't a thing. Come on. Yeah, I want to cross the dust. Come on. Uh -huh. Across the board, we next. I still love you. Love you, baby. Cause without you, there's no me. still for you, girl. I love you, girl. So the shocker, it ain't my fault. You can't stop. Guarantee 105.9 Jam Fresh Jams. 105.9 Jams. Tune up is over at, uh, where is it, Greenfield? Greenfield and Finko. Greenfield and Finko. Go by and check out my brother, the Tuna Man. He has plenty of free passes for you to join him over at uh, Franklin Street, BC, tomorrow night because we are sending somebody to see Janet Jackson in New York City tomorrow night. So go by and check him out. Greenfield and Finko. But before he left, he had a chance to talk to Jamie Foster Brown over in Studio B. Hey, Jamie, now what about that book? Uh, Tony Braxton got her groove back, too, well, huh? She said Miss Tony is just She's just feeling her oats now, honey. She said she hadn't seen the movie yet, but she just might get tipped to go get her groove back after seeing how, how Stella got her groove back. She said she might even write a book about how Tony got her groove back. She was hilarious. And I didn't know this, but Tony has been close, celibate for close to two years. Wow, too long. Uh-huh, she said, but I'm an artist, Jamie. I'm entitled to be fickle and change my mind. Ain't that the truth? Well, you know, that's how we women are. Anyway, she told me she's going to check the movie out and then decide whether or not she wants to get her groove back. Anyway, she's still going through the bankruptcy thing and the lawsuit with L.A. and, uh, and uh, Babyface, you know, with Arista and LaFace. Mm -hmm. However, she thinks that by the... You know, no later than the end of the year, everything will be clear, and she's happy. Well, you know what? That's a good thing, too. That's why she has such a great attitude now. She has a wonderful attitude, she, and she's silly. You know, a lot of people think, a lot of women think that she's real stuck up and stuff, but she's really a silly person. Well, anytime somebody's around you, Jamie, they be themselves. Well, that's true. That's true, darling. Because <laughs> we were doing some silly stuff, I'm telling you, some dangerous stuff while we were in that theater, you know, climbing up on a... Uh, um, we were trying to get up on the stage, and they had removed the doggone steps. Tony climbs up on the balcony and was going to jump over, jump over the uh, orchestra pit to get on the stage. And her people were like, Tony, Tony, please, please get down. See, that's the old tomboy coming out again. They, they were 
she said, well, Jamie is like family, and you know I want to do things like that. Okay. Hey, girl, have a good weekend, Jamie. You too, darling. And listen, don't forget to make the plans to listen to 105.9 at least four times a day, every day. Sister to sister, this weekend, while you're chilling out reading your book, Jamie, toll free number to order. 1-800. Bada boo. 828. Bada bing. 5099. Bada bomb. I'm Jamie Foster Brown on Detroit Jams, 105.9 Jams. Make no mistake about that. It's 936. J. Michaels, we got the Breakfast Jam. Spreads hanging out with me this morning. Tune up is over at the Greenfield and Finkel. Greenfield, Greenfield and Finkel. Finkel. All Finkel. right, go by. Finkel. Check him out. He has free passes for it. Uh, for Franklin, B.C.'s tomorrow night. Uh, also, tonight, we're over at Club Network tonight. Club Network. So get a fabulous party. Sunny will be there. Sunny's going to be out there. Sunny's going to be out there. Tunum's going to be out there tonight. I think I'm going to go out there Downtown. Tonight. You're going to head out there? That's where you can find a wife at, uh, at Network. At Network. There are some pretty ladies out there. I may go Beautiful. out there myself tonight. Yes. Ghetto Fabulous. Ghetto Fab. You can take me out of the ghetto, but you can't take the ghetto out of me. All righty. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Our old street music teaser is brought to you by the Michigan State Lottery. All right. Play three and four afternoon and evening games. Play six days a week. Mm -hmm. Be a player. Be a player. All right. Here we go. Our old school music teaser. Listen closely. I got it. I know what it is. So you was in Oklahoma. You was you down south. This is a big song. It's a big song. Huge song. You know it for real? I know it. Okay. Listen closely. I know it. That's all I'm going to play. I know it. 298 105.9 Jam. Just John B. I do what you say, boo. Five point nine jams. I do, I do, I do, my boo. I do. All right, it's uh, John B. And I do. So breakfast jam. Sunny is coming up in here uh, at seven. Up in here, like swimwear. Up in here. In fact, she just walked in. What's up, girl? What's up? Baby? What's up? She'll be in here at uh, ten o'clock. And tonight, she's going to be over at uh, Club Network. Yay, yeah, yay. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> That'll be the one saying that. You got all a right. fabulous baby. So you're looking forward to you fit right in. Yeah. Boy, you'll, be, so, uh, you'll be you'll be what? What you trying to say? <laughs> what you trying to say? I don't fit in. You're, you're, what you no. trying to say? No, he trying I mean, to tell me I'm ghetto fabulous. No, I'm just saying she's oh, okay. she's right there. Okay. Cool. Trying to sound good. Ghetto. Okay. okay. Well, you sound ghetto, yeah. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> all right, it's fun. All right, our old school music teaser. Here we go. Listen up again. And don't say it, all right? Listen up. Here we go. <laughs> I'm tripping. That's not it. I'm tripping. All right. Hold on. <laughs> oh, that's another one. Here we go. Listen up. All right. <laughs> one that's more time. One. one more time. Listen up. It's brought to you by the uh, Michigan uh, Michigan uh, Lottery. Listen up. Now you know. Six nine six nine. Yeah. You know it. Oh, that's some New Orleans stuff. Yeah. Who's this? Tina. Tina. Yes. What does that stand for? What does it stand for? Yeah. I have no idea. You, I mean, you don't have like like a. Shaquina, Shaquina. No, it's just Kina. It's just Kina. No, I know that song. That's my favorite song. It's your favorite song? Yes, it is. It is? Yes. Your favorite song? Yes. In the whole wide world? Yes. What is it? It's Lenny Williams because I love you. Yeah, girl. I won. You won? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. This is your favorite song? This is my favorite song, I swear. Is that right? And I'm only 23, but I love that song. So, will you tell everybody who's hey, listening right now it? where, uh, <laughs> where, uh, does this is where R. Kelly got his O, O, O from? Yeah. R. Kelly got it from this song right here. Yep, I knew that. All right, well, listen, you got passes to join Tuna tonight over at Club, uh, Club Network. Oh, yeah, tonight. tonight. So we'll see you at the party tonight, all right? Okay. Hey, Keena, I'm going to play your favorite song since you guessed it. The old school music teaser. Tell us something. What's the state in you, Keena, listen to the most? 105.9. Teaser, huh? Yeah, well, well, well. I love you. You see, I got home. You got my TV dinner, and I. Well. I 
sat down to watch Martin. MTV 